Hey everyone, it's Shane. I just wanted to take a moment to show you guys um, what a liquid peel will do. Um, so this is the vitamin C glow revealing liquid peel. However, um, the body shop, we do offer a drops of youth liquid peel as well. Um, I like the vitamin C a little bit more because one of my big concerns is brightening. Um, the drops use appeal with that one is more around anti-aging, uh, which definitely I'm concerned with aging as well. However, I do have some other anti-aging products that I use that I will talk about in another video. Um, so the most important thing, honestly, with this that I found myself having to describe or explain to customers time and time again in the retail stores is how to take the safety off of this. Um, I love it. It's a genius idea. But if you can kind of see, there's a little bit of a plastic cap here. Um, and it's just pressure release. So if you just kind of put your fingers behind it and then you pull off, it comes off like that. Um, I can't tell you how many times I had a customer bring this back. They said, I can't open it. It's defective. There's something wrong with it. And you pull off the lid and voila, there they go. Um, but this is probably one of the best um, exfoliators you can use. And I use the word exfoliator on purpose because when people see the word peel, they think that you put it on your face, you let it set and you peel it off like some other products that are on the market. This is not the case. Um, this is a product that you have to keep um, agitated the entire time you're using it to make it work. So let me show you in the back of my hand what this looks like. So you're just going to do a little bit of a pump. So you can kind of see the product there. Um, this one actually smells in my favorite a little bit more. In my favorite, that doesn't make sense. I like this smell more than the other one. It's my favorite. There we go. Um, it smells just kind of like bright oranges. Um, but So you just want to keep the product active while it's on your skin. So it kind of starts with a jelly texture. Don't try to do your whole face at one time because honestly, it's not going to work. I section mine off. So I'll do like my forehead. Then I'll do one cheek. Then I'll do the other cheek. Then I'll do my nose area. And then depending on my facial hair at the moment, I'll do like my neck or my chin area. But you'll start to kind of see the little white spots. That is actually my dead skin coming off. Fun fact there is at my retail store, I had one of my employees who didn't think that this product actually worked. And she thought that that was just a product drying on her skin. So she did a test. She um, was one of the people that are allergic to fake metals. So she um, used it on the green spot around her finger from the fake metal. Definitely took all the green skin away. So see all this white buildup? That is all dead skin. Disgusting, right? Think about how amazing this is on your face and what it will do to your skin to really transform it. So the important thing to remember here, guys, is that you want to use this on clean skin. So wash your face first, dry it, and then use this product in sections. Um, after that, just rinse it off, towel off. Um, be careful with your towel, though, because if you don't get all the residue off, it will stick in your towel, making your towel kind of icky. Um, so if you already have like a mask towel or something, use that. Otherwise, just make sure you rinse completely. But that is it. That is the vitamin C liquid peel. Um, also, the drops use liquid peel would work the very same way. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a great day.